Hi, welcome back out in the uh, practice bunker here at Barra Golf Club. We're just carrying on our bunker series here of trying to give you some different uh, swing tips in terms of what uh, you may find lie-wise in, in a bunker when you're out on that golf course. Obviously we can get faced with a lot of different situations here, so we're trying to cover a few different options here that you may get faced with on the golf course. This particular uh, bunker session here, or lesson we're going to give you, is, is how, to, how to create that sort of real high soft landing bunker shot. So this shot is particularly great when you get very close to the green, you've got very little green to work with and you need to get that ball up quickly, possibly a higher lip in front of you and to get that ball stopping quickly. Okay. Now what a lot of golfers do is straight away they go into the 60 degree or 62 degree lob wedge and try and lay the face wide open and try and play it like that. That's quite a difficult shot to play because you go into a club that has less bounce there. Okay, You still want to use some bounce here. So a simple tip is maybe just keep your sand wedge loft Okay, but what we're going to do is we're just going to change the left hand grip slightly and what we're just going to do here instead of it being a two knuckle position that you'll you see as a classic grip position you're going to weaken that off and turn the hand round to the left of the handle to maybe just see one knuckle only. Okay so here's a close up of what we're going to do here so as you would take a normal grip on the golf club you'd have two knuckles showing on that back of that left hand. Okay so what we're actually going to do is just turn the hand more to your left so more under the handle to the left hand side so as you're looking down you're only going to see maybe one knuckle here so this thumb is going more straight down the middle of the handle then introduce your right hand okay and what that's going to create us to do is to hold the loft on the golf club okay so what the last thing we want to do on this high floaty shot is for the club face as it comes in for it to turn and close or square up because that's going to make the ball come out slightly lower we want to keep this loft maybe open the face here we want to keep the loft working all the way through the shot and keep this club face presenting to the sky all the way through the shot and this weak, weakening of this left hand is just going to allow us to do that. Okay so let's play a shot here, I've got my 54 degree sandwich here so it's not all the massive amount of loft, obviously some, wedges, some sandwiches are 56 degrees so you can go into more loft. So I'm just going to lay the club face open a little bit and then I'm going to change my left hand grip as I've just described get one knuckle with that thumb going more down the middle of the grip. Now it does feel a little bit strange here, this takes a little bit of practice so do, don't just take this straight to golf course, do work on this first. I'm just going to play a shot here and you might just see how, how much higher this ball flight just comes as it, as it exits the sand and comes out. Okay now I've really got underneath that one, really slid, quite a full committed swing there and I've really slid that club right under that golf ball. You can see it's just popped out very very soft, okay, probably a bit too soft in a way. So I'm going to try that again. And this time I'm just going to try and take maybe a little bit more sand. Again, I'm going one knuckle, thumb right down the middle. Okay, and this time I'm probably not going to open the face as much. I'm going to square it off a little bit here. Okay, but I'm just going to open that, I'll just strengthen that grip a little bit. Sorry, weaken the grip a little bit. Okay, let's play this one. Yeah, it really does stop very quickly when it lands. And I know it's a little bit wet here at the moment, but that is stopping ultra quick. Okay, let's just play one more for you. I'll move this forward a little bit, okay. So again, just turning my hand, one knuckle. Let's just see how high this one pops out. Yeah, just a little bit of backspin on that. Just come back a little bit as well. Really high, soft landing shot, but I committed to it. And again, that's something I see with a lot of golfers is they get to this stage, and because the flag's so close to him. They make the swing, they de-accelerate, the ball just doesn't get out of that sand. Okay, so this way you can commit to it, again with a little bit of practice in here, it takes a little bit of confidence here, a little bit of practice, one knuckle, commit to the shot and you'll see some really high soft landing, landing ball flights. Okay, hope you enjoyed the video, comment down below, give that a go. If you have had a chance to have a go at it, comment below and let me know your findings, you know, did you see that higher sort of ball flight there? Okay, stay tuned, please subscribe and we'll see you all very soon.